So with protein, there's a different study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, and it had subjects on a 40% caloric deficit, which is a very aggressive deficit. So they had one group consume 1.2 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight. That's the low protein group. And that is about the ratio your average person eats in North America for protein. And the other group was the high protein group. They consumed 2.4 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight, but their calories were identical. So they ate the same amount of calories exactly, just coming from different macros, different foods. But this is the most important thing to point out. And the result, the high protein group actually still build muscle, even in a 40% calorie deficit. The high protein group had an increase of lean body mass of 1.2 kilograms, even in a deficit, which if you ask a lot of people, even personal trainers, they would tell you that is not possible, not feasible. Well, the science is pretty clear. It is possible, albeit it's not ideal. 